Guys, what's going on here? There's a whole crowd gathered. We found a little mermaid egg. We don't know what to do with it. Interesting. I'll take care of it. <laughs> Let's use Play-Doh for sculpting. Shape a tiny mermaid. Refine the details. Add colors. A blue tail with a fin. Dark hair and a cute face. Take a plastic half sphere. Yay, slime! Put the baby in the egg. Everything's in place. The mermaid will soon be born. Here we are at home. Where should I put you? For now, on a pillow. But we need to find another option. The sea creatures bring a seashell bed. Wow, thank you. Just what I needed. Mm. The egg was growing quickly. Wow. Oh, it's time to consult with the doctor. What should I do next? Let's go. Come here, little one. Lalalu magic. Details are ready. Sewing machine, get to work. A doctor's coat is ready. Cut out a collar. A piece of old cord. Wire. Sewing details. The stethoscope head. Put on the ear pads. The doctor's costume is ready. Ursula becomes a doctor. Mm -hmm. Okay, who's next? Hi, I don't have an appointment. Oh, no worries. Come to the examination okay. table. Let's listen to you. First, the head. Oh, what a huge belly. How far along are you? It's a bandage with the egg. <laughs> hmm, the first time I have seen such a thing. Okay, let's listen to it too. Mm -hmm. You should get an ultrasound. I'll write a referral. Here you go. Thank you, doctor. Phew, now rest. So good. Let's have a cookie. The cup is empty. Cut off the edges. Boo, take these pebbles. Thanks. A strip of foam paper. Cut out a star. Conjure up some glitter parts. Cover the piece. Attach the spool to the center. Set up the incubator. Cover it with a lid. Connect the pop tubes. Assemble the stand. Put the control panel next to the device. The incubator will help the eggs grow. Ursula brings Ariel to the lab. Wow. This is a cutting edge device for mermaid eggs. Put it in. Settings. Oh, it'll hatch soon. Wow. Yay, I'm intrigued. A puff of smoke rises. Through the mist, a tiny mermaid appears. My baby! Oh, science is all powerful. I wish I could become a scientist. You can. I actually need an assistant. Put on the coat. Okay. Welcome to the team. Woohoo! Deal! Woohoo! Nice. Let's choose some foam paper. Here's our mermaid. Hello. Trace the fin's contour. Frame it with foam paper. Sand the edges. Paint it over. Gather some beads. Install a panel with buttons. The massage bathtub will help to relax after a long day. Oh, I'm so tired. Oops, ow! I should have put this bathtub away earlier. All right, your place is behind the screen. Doctor, help! My tail hurts! Oh, let's see what's wrong with you. Sit here, please. 
Okay. Oh, it hurts so much. Oh, no wonder. Your tail has a lot of pressure. I know what you need. I recommend taking a fin bath. Oh, you'll love it. Oh, I feel better already. Oh, yeah. Oh, so relaxing. Thank you, Dr. Ursula. <laughs> Let's make an electrocardiograph. Empty a container. Draw a circle. Wow! Trim the wire. Add sew on buttons. Print out a display. Cut a strip of cardiogram. This device will help monitor the heart. <laughs> oh dear, uh, getting old isn't fun. We have a new patient. Hey! A good day, what's bothering you? <laughs> oh, my heart is acting up, it's worrying. <laughs> oh, you're in good hands. Mm -hmm. Oh, I have no doubt. We'll do an ECG. Attach the sensors. Let's see what we have here. Wow, your pulse is off the charts. I'll be right back. Oh, there's no cure for a love. I'll run to get some flowers. I'm back. Oh. Triton, where are you? Oh, he vanished. Oh, well. Let's borrow a foam rubber backrest. Change the shape. Repaint it blue a piece of fabric. Use a Velcro fastener. Done. The collar will keep your neck in the correct position. Ariel is reading her textbooks. I'll definitely become a good doctor. And here comes the first patient. Hello. Doctor, help! My neck is pinched. Oh. An interesting case. Hmm. Uh, just a moment, I'll check the library. Let's see, where's the reference book? Hmm? Aha, you need a supportive collar. <laughs> Put it on, it'll help. Perfect. Oh, it hurts so much less now. Well, I'm gonna go hey. now. Oh, wait, wait, you should be monitored for a couple more days. <laughs> Take a couple of shells. Apply hot glue like seaweed. Add a little green. Curly wheels. Want a chupa chups? The stick will come in handy. Assemble the broom. Bucket. Hello. I want to help. Oh, uh, sure, but first let's draw a coat. Here's your hat. The new worker is ready for the shift. Sebastian got a job as a hospital janitor. The hall is entirely sterile. Phew, I finished cleaning. Now, time to rest. Uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. A little snail crawled in. Oops, it left slime all over the hall. Mamma mia, what happened here? I left it clean. Oh, ew, slime. Uh, I have to scrub it all over again. Like this. A bit left on the vending machine. Uh, who are you? Gotcha. Shoo, shoo. Away from here. Oh, what a tough job. We'll need a ring box. Paint it. A couple of pieces. Tea break. Cut pieces of napkin. Secure it to the body. Cut the straws. Attach to the device. Brush cap. Connect the wire. The inhaler will help patients breathe. Who's next? Come in. Hello. Oh, Ursula, I returned just for you. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Triton, you again. My love. <laughs> oh, you'll need a ventilator. <laughs> Connect the device. Breathe through your mouth, exhale through your nose. 
Just breathe first. I'll be right back to you. Who added a potion to the ventilator? It brought back Triton's youth. Whoa. It's a miracle. I'm young. <laughs> oh, where's Triton? Did he run away again? Wait, is that you? Will you agree to go on a date with me? How can I refuse? <laughs> Take a napkin dispenser. Cut a strip. Sectors. Make the folder smaller. The shark grounded the plastic. Seaweed. Pour caviar beads. Corn porridge. Empty a small flask. Trim the edge. Pour slime. Vitamin cocktail. Cutlery included. The usual meal of a hospital kitchen. Eric is bored in the hospital. Hello. Lunch time. Enjoy your meal. Wait, where's the good stuff? Hmm. Ugh, this food is nasty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I won't get better with this diet. Buddy, here's a burger. Oh, my saving. Mmm, tasty. What didn't he like? Well, did you manage? Wow. Good job. Proper eating speeds up recovery. <laughs> Take a small jar. Oh, 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 I'm a gentleman. Undoubtedly. Connect the plastic. Repaint the shell. Take out a pin. Cut the straw handle. Blue detail. Sequins. And the tube mount. Use old headphones. Ultrasound screen. Control panel. Add oceanic decorations. An ultrasound machine is necessary for examinations. Ariel sat in the office. Triton and Ursula came for a consultation. Hello. Oh, what's bothering you? A doctor, I'm so bloated. Oh. We'll do an ultrasound and find out what's wrong. Lie down. Oh. I'm so nervous. Our machine works flawlessly. Wow! What? What's there? What? Woohoo! Oh, happy news! What's going on? We're going to be parents! Aww. What a happy ending! We'll need a small piece of modeling clay. Make a ball. And wrap it with a long piece. Wow, that's Sebastian! Oh, he's so cute! Hmm, red is a good choice. Shape a pair of big claws. Wire frame lets them bend. Paint them red. Sebastian is really surprised. <laughs> Yay, we're having a wedding under the sea. The guests are ready, but where are the bride and groom? Welcome, the newlyweds. I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. It's time for the couple to exchange rings. The best man is coming. I'm carrying them. Just a minute. Oops, I dropped them. Oh, these claws. Oh, no. Found it. The wedding is saved. <laughs> Eric and Ariel, you may exchange rings. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Woohoo! <laughs> We have plastic caps. Get foam paper details ready. It looks like a shell. Which fabric do we choose? Blue. Let's listen to his opinion. Join the haps. 
The shell can close. Put it in the crib. The little mermaids will love sleeping here. It looks beautiful, but something's missing here. There is a delivery for you! Sign for it! Wow, it's a crib! Soon we'll hear the sound of tiny fins splashing. <laughs> but what's that? A shell crib opened! Unbelievable! Two big pearls! What does that mean? Hmm. What secrets is this shell hiding? The LOL babies have blue eyes now. Dye the hair. Babies are wearing gold and silver shirts. <laughs> wow, got a tail! <laughs> Red and purple fins? How beautiful! Decorate with glitter. Hmm, pink doesn't match. It should be red like mom's. <laughs> That's much better. Cover with acrylic polish. <laughs> I want to find out what's inside the shell. Hmm. <laughs> to the couple's amazement, babies appeared in place of the pearls. Hmm? So cute! <laughs> But it's not easy to hug the children. Huh, they have so much energy. They went in different directions. You can't chase them. Oh, we barely managed to catch them. Outline the template of a stingray on blue and white foam paper. Cut it out. Glue on a wire. Fill with synthetic stuffing. The stingray got a long tail and a pair of funny eyes. Snap! The back sparkles with glitter. Wow, he's moving his fins. What a wonderful creature. From now on, everyone forgot about peace and quiet. The daughters only want to race with their parents. <sighs> oh, I'm so tired. Call the babysitter. Glad to see you, Ariel, baby. Oh, you were my super nanny. You used to be a handful. <laughs> the stingray can definitely handle the sisters. Here you are. Jump in, I'll give you a ride. He has his own methods. He doesn't have to swim after the babies. They will ride on his back. Woohoo! Ah, we can finally rest. Time went by so quickly. The girls are already teenagers! And we'll work on your look. The top sparkles with gold foam paper. Hey, what about the tail? Make a tail out of sequin fabric. Add a belt. Tool inserts will complete the look. There are pearls sparkling everywhere. But where is her sister? Symphony, are you ready? Of course! Oh, you look great! You too! <laughs> what should we do? Let's test our luck. Symphony goes first. Where it stops, nobody knows. Hmm? This one. Oh, I didn't guess it right. It's my turn to lead. Symphony can do everything on the first try. Yeah! What are my favorite girls doing? I hope I'm not distracting them. Help me find my favorite pendant. <laughs> of course, we'll look everywhere. The girls started searching. Uh, it's not here. Hmm? Where did it go? There it is. Symphony found it first. But she decided to help Melody, so she doesn't get upset. Oh, here is the pendant. Dad! Thanks, girls. I couldn't have done it without you. Well, there are a lot of stones on the shore. This one will fit. Take a couple of shells. 
put a piece together. Decorate the drum set with greenery and seaweed. Sea stones can be used for decor. Hit the shelves. Wow, a solo from Flounder. Bravo! While Melody was hanging out with some fish, Symphony's friends came. They have their own musical group. We'll rehearse a little. One girl is blowing on a shell. The boy is playing guitar. And Symphony is playing the drums. Guys, you're so cool. Can I try? Yes, of course. Melody took the drumsticks, but... Oops, one drum is broken and the stick cracked. Sorry. That's okay, there are plenty of shells around. Maybe I should try the guitar? Uh-oh, the string broke. <laughs> That's okay, they break all the time. Oh, I know what you can do. Take maracas. Yeah, it's working. Melody became part of the band. We can't wait to hear their underwater hits. There, there are, are rare, rare shells, shells in the, in the chest. chest. Paint them white. Add gold. Snap. Add glitter. Join the halves and pull a ring through. Add an accessory chain and secure the clasp. It's time to start the family tournament. We'll be racing seahorses. I'd like to ride. Melody and Symphony are coming up to the start. Good luck, grandkids. On your marks, set, go! Sisters went ahead. They are close together. But suddenly, Symphony's seahorse started galloping, beating Melody. Finish! Did I really win? Yeah! Congratulations, sister. The parents came to congratulate their daughters. Grandpa Triton joined them. <laughs> Flounder, bring us the prize. This pendant is passed from generation to generation to all the winners. It's yours, baby. No. I don't want it. Symphony separated the pendant in half <laughs> since her sister was wow. just as good at racing. That's so sweet. Thank you. Congratulations. Let's grow this. Wow, a bottle is turning into a sunken submarine. Bam, a plastic sphere broke. There is a container on top. And a styrofoam block on the bottom. Cut out a couple of fins. Secure them to the sides. Apply white acrylic paint. Dive in. Submarine became yellow. Foam paper strips protect the attachment points. Make round windows. Secure the loops. Decorate the boat with metal half beads. A textured straw is coming out of the top hatch. Add blades. How many years did it spend under the sea? We don't know. The submarine is covered in silt and moss. Flounder, how did you get there? He loves researching lost objects. It's time to go on an adventure. What a beautiful pearl. There are lots of them on the sea floor. Wow. Ooh, something new. Whoa, a sunken submarine. How do I get inside? The vent was hard to open. Let's study it from the inside. But a strong current closed the door. Ah, I'm trapped. Help! Sebastian, I'm here! Oh, uh, no, wait, maybe not. But he's not strong enough to save the young princess. Hmm. I'll go get help. 
trim them and glue on chopsticks. Paint it blue. Is that the nose of a sawfish? Turn a plastic case into a body. Add fins and a tail. Highlight it blue. Secure the saw. Add glitter, sequins, and pointy fins. The sea has some unusual creatures. Fortunately, Melody is already near. Oh, it's not moving! Hmm. Stop panicking. I'll come up with something. Maybe I can use this? But it wasn't strong enough. We need to search for something stronger. Hmm? Ooh, a sawfish! Help us, please! What will I get for it? How about candy? Oh, perfect! Let's swim! A couple of movements, and Symphony is free again! Are you okay? Yes, thank you! Good job, baby! Have some sweets! Wow. The adventure ended well! Make an arch out of a wire. Wrap with a gold ribbon. Decorate with plastic details. The crown is ready! Secure the base of a trident to a wooden handle. Paint it gold and cover it with a cord. Sprinkle the cap with glitter. Add rhinestones. Voila! The symbols of royal power are restored. Triton swam to a lost submarine to help his grandkids. Melody, Symphony, I've been looking everywhere for you. We figured it out. It wasn't easy, but it was a real adventure. Be careful. I used to be like you when I was your age. <laughs> Let's go home. Triton invited the grandkids to the throne room. I want to compliment Melody on her bravery and quick thinking. My girl can help anyone. You deserve to be the one on the throne and make the underwater world better. I'm so honored. Wow. Congratulations, sister. <laughs> the parents are happy with their daughters. They both found their perfect place in the underwater world. Choose like clay. Shape it as a fish. Add a fin to the top. The fish is looking at us with green eyes. Flounder is ready to swim around the sea. When Ariel was a little baby, Triton always carried her in his arms. But kids need so much attention. <sighs> Flounder, can you help me put the baby to bed? I can't catch a break. While Triton was putting baby Ariel into the crib, Flounder was trying to remember some lullabies. Hush, little baby, don't say a word. <sighs> oh, she fell asleep. Yay, we did it. You're doing great, Flounder. I'm always happy to help. Gradually, the mermaid started to grow up. The baby has blue eyes. <laughs> Make a tail and create a scaly texture. Make the top lilac. The baby has bright red hair, the color of corals. <laughs> Ariel is studying every corner of the underwater kingdom. Oh, dad forgot his trident. I need to give it back. Suddenly, she had an unexpected guest. It's Olaf. Yes. Who are you? Hmm? Just a snowman from Arendelle. <laughs> you want to fight? Ah! She's dangerous. Swim away! <laughs> Wait, I'll catch you. Oh, I'm giving up. I just wanted to make friends. <laughs> you really look harmless. Ariel and Olaf decided to be friends. The baby was studying Olaf's scuba device. You can't breathe without it, right? Yes. <laughs> That's silly. I'll use my trident to turn you into a merman. Wow! Olaf has a great tail! It suits you. Wow! 
No, Olaf, you're in the wrong cartoon. Oops, I'll have to cancel my magic. I'll miss you. Bye. Snap, a sheet of paper became a coloring book. Put the pages together. Disney princesses are looking at us from the pages. Turn pieces of toothpicks into crayons. Let's draw. Ariel is a very creative girl. That's why Flounder decided to surprise her with a gift. Hey, swim with me. What's there? Hmm? There were crayons and a coloring book on the table. Hmm. Wow, thanks. Ariel started coloring. This is Olaf, my friend. When did you meet him? Flounder has his own ideas for how he should look. That's so silly. <laughs> what did you do? That's just my artistic vision. <laughs> <laughs> Cover a glass ball with modeling clay. Shape it as a tail. And what's that? A snout? This, this is a merpig with a pink snout and a pearly tail. A piggy bank will help Ariel save money. The mermaid was swimming around the sea garden. Oh, a beautiful flower. I haven't seen it before. As soon as she turned around, she saw a surprise. A pirate treasure. Yay, my first. Where is the sound coming from? Hmm? Wow, this is a piggy bank. Now I have a fortune. <laughs> All thanks to my merpig. <laughs> hey, I can't see. <clears throat> oh, sorry. Turn wet wipes into a hat. And here is some synthetic hair. The royal stylist helped us get hair extensions. Straighten the strands. Yay! Light clay created a couple of shells to make a top. Wow, so sparkly. The scales of the tail look gorgeous. Make fins out of a folder. Add a belt. The heiress to a royal throne looks fabulous. Triton fell asleep during the day. Ariel decided to use this moment to steal his trident. Hehe, <laughs> I'll just play with it. She met Flounder on her way. Watch what I can do. <laughs> Ariel swung the trident and turned the fish into an octopus. Hey, give me my fin back. Quiet, shh, I'll fix everything. But her experiments weren't working. Oh, I hope it's not a turtle. It worked! Yay! Suddenly, Ariel felt someone's presence. Oops, Triton was standing behind her. Oh, Dad, you woke up. Hmm, I think that belongs to me. We were just about to return it. Uh-huh. Flounder was helping me polish it. Without my permission, don't take it again. But thanks for polishing it. <laughs> oh, I got off easy. Phew. Hmm, a ribbon? Interesting. Undo it to make threads. Get rid of the bead and bend it. These are hair extensions. Now we can experiment with different hair colors. Ariel was sleeping in her bed. It's so cozy here. But Flounder decided to interrupt her rest. Hello, Ariel. Wow, what's that? While she's sleeping, I'll try it on. Hee <laughs> hee, I have a pink beard. The fish started laughing. <laughs> and tickling Ariel's nose with hair. ha oh, Good morning. Oh, you found my hair extensions. <laughs> I can do it too. The friends were laughing and having fun. <laughs> Flounder helped Ariel create a nice hairstyle. Thanks, Flounder. And now, I'll race you to the reef. There are so many different decorations. Cover the center with clay and add some texture. Secure a sequence to make rows of scales. Wow, they're so sparkly. Highlight the end silver and cover the speakers with a net. The buttons are here. Just press play and enjoy the music. Ariel has wanted to have an underwater party for a long time. Let's see what will happen next. She turned the sound up and left the speaker on the table. The music got her friend's attention. This thing is singing. Oh, just dance. Woohoo, it's so fun. The mermaids party till the sun went down. Yay! 
The mermaid grew up a little more. Ursula noticed her changes too. <laughs> My time has come. Ariel asked the witch to show her what it's like to be a human. Legs replace the tail. Put on a dress. Make a tool underskirt. Try it on. Mmm. Wow, it's so beautiful. Ariel turned into a beautiful princess. You can't take your eyes off her. Prince Eric was looking at the sea. Suddenly, he noticed something in the waves. Who's that? After coming closer, the prince was stunned. Looks like it's love at first sight. Mm. Whoa, it's magic! Ariel's tail turned into a beautiful dress. Oof, I'll have to practice walking. <laughs> we can handle it together, honey. And the prince led Ariel to the castle. It's so beautiful here. Wow. This is where we'll raise our family. But by the way, did you want to look in the mirror? Hmm? While Ariel was looking at her legs, she found the disadvantages of life on land. Cold marble floors were making her feet freeze. Purr, it's chilly. Oh, I'll give you some shoes. Styrofoam platforms are ready to go. Cover the shoes with foam paper. Connect all the details. Decorate the platform with glittery foam paper. Crocs for a real princess are covered in sparkly stars. Ariel, take a seat. I prepared a huge selection of gorgeous shoes. Mm. Go ahead and choose. Let's start with these heels. Oh. Oops, oh, they're too high. Are you hurt? Sorry, I messed up. Maybe gold ones will fit? But the princess could barely walk in them too. <gasps> what should I do? The prince is desperate. Ah but a helping hand gives him a perfect pair of sea-themed shoes. Hmm, not bad. Yeah, I feel very comfortable. Really? Oh, I'm so happy that your feet are warm. The happy couple started dancing. Take some threads. Make vertical cuts. We need to pull the threads evenly. We made a wicker basket with convenient handles. We have a full basket of wool. Toothpicks turned into metal spikes. Old Ariel is sitting on her deck chair, enjoying the warm sun. Ooh. Now Grandma can relax and knit. Oh, I'll make a cute blanket. <laughs> I made a mermaid tail. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. I remember I had one like this. Hello, mermaid. Don't swim too far. Her granddaughter is swimming in the sea. She has the ability to turn her tail into legs and back whenever she wants. Ariel put on a warm tail and continued to enjoy the lovely day. Oh.